Hey guys, I'm here with no smooch this time. I'm alone because I'm PvP a little bit alone because of this comment right here. I don't I don't like the fact that people think smooch is carrying me. Maybe in videos it looks like he is carrying me, but like I like to ask people who are with me in call opinion. I like to see how they would play, and sometimes I bite it. Sometimes I'll be like, hmm, okay, let's try this. But I play much better when when I'm alone because Smooch and I have different mindsets. We play differently. We have different play styles. So sometimes he would do things that I wouldn't, and maybe it doesn't work the way I wanted it to work. And I just you know follow his uh, suggestions because I like to try different things that makes the video better. But some of you. Truly think I can't PvP without him. Truly think that Smooch carries him, even though I used to get leather before even meeting him. So like, I'm gonna prove right now that I actually can PvP without him, and I play much better without him. So there you go, we found a game. This guy is zero rating, but it's the beginning of the season, so we can't really judge if he's good or not based on the rating. Um, he has a Mega Gyarados, and it, this is a Sun team? With a Gengar and Gyarados. This Gyarados probably doesn't have Waterfall because it's on, but I'm not gonna really judge. Um, I'm gonna lead Torko because he has a Glide Score too and he has a chance to lead Glide Score. Oh, I, <laughs> I led with Charizard anyway. I forgot to click. I'm sorry. That was a misclick. Um, he's probably gonna yawn and, you know, do Torko stuff, but I'm gonna go Torko right away or yeah i have to go torco right away and hopefully he clicks stealth rock and not yawn okay good so if i i have to stealth rock here because he has a ganger he has a ghost type mm. misclicking there wasn't very good for me because now he has momentum but it's okay um yeah like Charizard doesn't KO Torko even after Dragon Dance and Earthquake, and he could just yawn, so he stayed. I'm gonna Rapid Spin here because the chance of him staying into Rapid Spin as well is big. So I'm gonna yawn now. I don't know why he's not clicking yawn, maybe he doesn't know how to play. And I'm gonna Stealth Rock right now Because he has to go Gengar Right What is it doing? Okay, I'm gonna go Skarmory, I think Because he's probably going Gengar And I think I'll leave a Shadow Ball Maybe not, to be honest Um... I'll try though in case he stays. He stayed. Okay, defog here. I don't know what he's doing. Um. There is nothing in my team that really deals with Torko, so I think I'm gonna go Golan and explode so he can't Stealth Rock? He can, he can actually Stealth Rock. Mm, maybe I won't explode then, maybe I'll just click Earthquake. Staying in, he really wants to stealth rock. It's okay. He's switching as Gliscor, and he's not going Gliscor. And he burned my Alolan Golan. Go Gliscor, fuck. All right. So against that.
I feel like I have to go Torco and pray it's not a subs, Gyarados. Have to go Torco to get the sun and then Venusaur can do something about it. Or I could go Skarmory and counter, but it has a chance his subs, so let's go Torco first. Mega Rattle, eh? Earthquake Rattle. Uh, now I'm gonna, you know, um, let Golan die. I'm gonna go Golan explode because I really want Golan to just die so I can go Skarmory and probably Defog. So I'm just gonna explode here. The fact that he burned me, I, I just don't get it. I never burn, and they burn it first turn, you know? It's messed up. But anyway, I'm just going to defog because I should leave anything he uses. He went Venusaur, good, it's probably HP Fire. Um, probably gonna Growth and all that. I don't leave a plus two Sludge Bomb on my... On my Charizard. Maybe I should go Blissey to Stealth Rocks and let it die. Or I can even let Torkoal die, but I should get a Stealth Rock. Oh, let's see, this is a Mega. No. His guy was mega. Uh, lead seed on a chlorophyll Venusaur. That's interesting. Growth. There we go. Sun should end soon. I hope. I'm gonna let my Torco die here. Sun didn't end, so I'm gonna go Blissey again. I'm just I wanna install the sun so I can go Charizard and kill it. There you go. So I either let Blissey die or let Skarmory die. I think I need Blissey more than Skarmory because he has a Gengar. Hmm, he also has a Gyarados. But once I Dragon Dance, I think I'm fine. So I think I'm gonna Soft Blow to see how much it does. Okay, Poison me, so I should go Skarmory and let it die. Yeah, I didn't want that to happen, but it's okay. <laughs> Kid doesn't have HP fire. Sludge bomb. Oh yeah, sludge bomb growth lead seed. It just blows my mind that he has lead seed and not <laughs> HP fire. It makes no sense. But anyway, now I go Charizard and I kill it with a fire punch. He won Chansey. I probably won't do anything. I burned him at least. Do I kill with a Dragon Claw? 
Let's see. We could also go Torco here and then Growth with Venusaur to win, but I want to test Dragonite's, uh, not Dragonite, Charizard damage, you know? I did not kill it and he toxic me, that's shame. I need to keep Charizard alive for Venusaur. He, here goes Gengar, I think I can go Blissey. Destiny Bond? Wow. A soft pile here. Probably doesn't have taunt, doesn't look like it. A soft pile again. I'm gonna attack. Because I obviously don't kill it. Uh, he went straight Gyarados. Hopefully I burn it. <laughs> if not, I have to just Toxic. He doesn't KO me with anything. He could flinch me. But I want to Toxic in case he Dragon Dances. But I could just go Venusaur. You know? Sacrifice Torko, go Venusaur. Easy peasy. There we go. Um, I think I'll do that now. I think I'm just gonna go Torko instead of letting him flinch my Blissey. Uh, yeah, I'll do that now. This could be crazy. But I kind of want to growth right here. Because if I don't, I lose to his entire team. So I'm going to growth. I don't think he KOs me. There you go. So I'll kill the Gengar with probably HP fire because I don't want to get, get disabled. Uh, yep, I don't want to get disabled, so HP fire. I could kill with Gengar Drain. I think I KO, but it's okay. Uh, yeah, after that I just went. Pretty sure I killed this with my sludge bomb. I don't know what would do more damage. Let me open calculations. Okay. <sighs> now I'm just waiting for him to come with his. What does he have left? Glass current toast. Gliscor and Torkoal. So, yeah, you can drain here. The reason why I like to record with Smooch is because the video is more interactive. I have more fun recording with Smooch. But I also like to give my own explanation of things. I, I even forgot that Turco was almost dead. Uh, so yeah, as you can see, I won a game without Smooch, haha. Uh, I'll play more, uh, not now, but I'll play more alone later when I have more time. So you guys can see I don't really need Smooch to leather. This guy was a zero rating and his team wasn't very great. So I know that a lot of you will say she played against a noob, so that doesn't count. But yeah, uh, I'll play more eventually without a smooch. And if you like videos like this, that's only me, you know, PvPing with no one else. 
Um, just, you know, like, comment something, let me know what you like, and I'll play more. I know that I don't really need to prove myself to anybody, but like, sometimes when everybody starts to say that, I feel like I have to do something because I don't want people believing that I need Smooge to carry. I never needed him and it's just dumb that people feel that way. Uh, yeah, I mean, I know that Smooge is a better PvPer than me, for sure. He plays this game for a longer time than I do, he has more experience and he's more used to checking calculations and stuff like that. He's faster than me on that. I can do that too, but I'm just a little slower, so I prefer to ask him to do it for me so the video doesn't take one year and I don't have to cut a lot, you know? But if you guys think this is caring, then I prefer just to do it myself because I can. And, and then I will be waiting for the next excuse for you guys to say I'm being carried. Okay, that's it. Goodbye.